Hey guys, so for today's video, I'm going to do a purpley pink look. I'm not 100% sure exactly how it's going to go, but I feel pretty good about it because I'm going to be using the James Charles palette again, so it like never steers me wrong. Sometimes the shimmers do give me a little bit of a hard time, but other than that, I really like this palette. So let's get started. Uh, but first, off camera, I'm going to go apply this It Cosmetics Bye Bye Under Eye Concealer as my eyeshadow primer. As you can tell, I have my base done, so all of the products that I used will be listed in the description bar. So I have the concealer on my eyelids and taking this e.l.f. contour brush, I'm taking the shade Escape and I'm going to stamp this on the outside part of the crease and slightly into the inner corner. another one of the elf contour brushes with the shade love that I'm going to stamp just over top of the edge of the purple this crease blending brush from Vanity Planet, I'm going to go just on the edge of the shade Love That and also blend it out. using the shade Love That to blend into the shade Skip a little bit more. So this is what it's looking like so far. I know it looks really crazy right now, but I'm going to take just a clean blending brush. This one's from the Morphe 18 piece vegan set and I'm going to blend out the edges. Off camera, I'm gonna go and cut my crease halfway using the same Bye Bye Under Eye Concealer by It Cosmetics. And if I forgot to mention, it's in the shade Medium. I'm going to take that same e.l.f. contour brush that had the shade Escape on, and I'm going to tap that over the edge just to help blend and make it a more seamless transition. the 
taking this medium concealer brush from Vanity Planet. I'm taking the shade Single and I'm going to pack it on my lid until right about here. So basically where the pupil ends, not the pupil, where like the color of your eye ends. Taking this small shadow brush from Vanity Planet, I'm taking the shade Flashback and I'm going to put it from the inner corner till about halfway through the pupil. Next, taking artistry on my finger, I'm going to pack this all over my lid. Taking this M560 from Morphe, I'm taking the shade Love That and I'm going to take the shade from the outer corner till about halfway. So sorry if you guys didn't see any of that. I tried, but I forgot to look at the screen. Taking that same crease brush from earlier that had the shade Skip on it, I'm going to blend that shadow out. I'm just gonna blend out using a clean brush. I'm gonna go pop some mascara and lashes on and a lip and I'll be right back and I'll show you when I'm back all of the choices that I made. For lashes, I decided to go with these by Morphe and they're in the style so charming. So for glue, I used my usual duo dark tone and for mascara, I used the Too Faced Better Than Sex mascara and for lips, I went in with this NYX liquid suede in the shade Vintage and with all that being said, this is the finished look and I hope you guys liked it. If you recreate this look, tag me on Instagram and don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, turn on the bell to be notified of every time I upload and follow me on all my social medias to be notified of all of the other looks that I do and I will see you guys next Wednesday. Bye.